fabulous fam, Zbex here, aka Zidade, and I'm here with Rockstar. Hello. And tonight we're going to be opening Unsanctioned and playing a game. Are you ready for the all out brawl? Let's go ahead and open the Unsanctioned. I'm excited. Yes, so this silver bordered product, you get five 30 card decks in it. Uh, and the idea behind this is that each of those decks is constructed in such a way that you then shuffle up two of them and you're ready to go. Uh, so we'll go over some of these cards here and give you an idea of what you can find in the deck. Uh, some older cards like Old Fogey and Bingo from Unglued, Unhinged, Unstable. Uh, and some new cards in here too. Uh, like I really like this one, Pippa, Duchess of Dice. She has really big dice for sleeves. Wow. Yeah. Uh, what do you have in your deck? Johnny Combo. Yeah, An oldie but a goodie. The originator of magic himself, Richard Garfield, PhD. Oh, that comes in this? I didn't know that. Uh, don't you have a foil of that? I might on my desk, yeah. It's pretty cool. Ah, another classic, Timmy Power Gamer. I actually shared uh, the new art of this card when it was spoiled. He spoiled some of this stuff uh, like a few months ago, so I haven't, I don't remember what it is, so I'm excited just to play and be, uh, revealed again to me these new cards that's right we're gonna battle it out mad scientist getting going to war um all right well yeah just some more comments and stuff in here uh now you may notice that last friday we didn't have a box for episode come out speaking of the warring we're going to be doing the unsanctioned match war for you Season one of Box Wars is over. Theros is done. It was a good season. It was a good season, but you'll have to join us during Ikoria. Ikoria? Ikoria. Ikoria. Ikoria uh, for more Box Wars. Uh, so that'll be happening in April. I mean, there's new things coming. What are we going to do with the box toppers? You'll have to find out. Yeah. Um, okay. And then there's, besides all of the uh, uncards that you get, augment, I was trying to say segment earlier, it's augment. I was close. <laughs> Poor hosts can get augmented. <laughs> um, you also get... Bad squirrel, kitten, beagle, what, where's the, oh, no, no beagle, sorry. Just, just an insect wrestler. <laughs> off the top rope. <laughs> um, yeah. Step back, Alexander Clamels in here. <laughs> Things are getting real unsanctioned over here. Can't even keep the cards in our hands. Uh, a, a growth spurt, so to speak. Oh my gosh, these cards are so funny. I can't wait to get playing with some of them. Um, well, let me show you some of the, the lands that are really cool that come in here because we're almost through the end of this 30 card deck. We just, we're just flying through them. Uh, you get some awesome full art lands in here. Some regular ones. Like the Unproducts have some of the greatest lands in Magic's history. And these, they've got that traditional border that yeah. came with the original Unlands. A little tap symbol in the middle, but the mana symbol. And then the foils on these. The foils. Look at. Old foiling. Yeah, nice. the edging on that, it's almost like. Um, Gold leafing, but just that, that foil just really pops right there. Really nice. Uh, speaking of foil cards, while we're showing off some of these, my giveaway for the foil promo soul ring is still going on. Uh, so if you wanted a chance to win this, the giveaway is going on through March 10th, and one of my lucky subscribers will be getting it. Just look for the win a soul ring video with my face and this soul ring on it uh, to find out all the details how to win. Foil soul ring. That's so cool. Yes. So. Commander players, like every commander player plays it in their deck. So. 
goes in everything. Well, that is unsanctioned. We're gonna get ready to play, uh, but first you should know that this unsanctioned match war is sponsored by Addictive Behaviors. Where you can find thousands of individual magic cards uh, online at ccgobsession.com. And if you'd like to get the unsanctioned product, box sets are $60. Roll to see what deck we get. Uh, one through five. There we go. I got two. I got one. All right. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, five. Four. Okay, All perfect. Right. Oh. Opening hand. I have some stuff. I will get ready to bring this to the table. I only have uh, one land. Uh, I'm going to mulligan. And thanks to the Vancouver Mulligan, I get to draw seven cards. What? All right. Uh, sure, I will keep and put that on the bottom. Okay. Okay. It's so cute. Now what are you going to do? Oh. Uh, where's the dice go? We, we have uh, more dice than this, presumably, right? Three. Yeah, we have a lot of dice. Okay, 23. Go ahead. Okay. It's so cute. I gain life. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw. I will play a land for the turn, and then I will pass to you. Meow. And go ahead. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw. I will play an island and cast a wild crocodile. When it enters, I will search for a basic land card. Sound good? Do it. Revealing, oh look, an island, and it goes into my hand, then shuffle my library. Pass to you. The crocodidimus over there. My little kitten will, watch out for my little kitten. Ah! Cat scratches. These, those can be, those can get infected. Okay, boom stacker. We hit another. We hit one of the new cards here, Goblin Artificer. When it enters the battlefield, you stack two dice on top of it. <laughs> boom stacker gets plus one plus one for each dice in the stack. And when boom stacker attacks, each combat a fable. Uh, when the stack falls, sacrifice boom stacker. Ah. So I have to keep adding uh, more dice when it attacks as well. It gets plus one plus one for each dice in the stack. So oh, okay. Well, we need some dice. Let me yeah. Let me give you a full selection of this random variety of dice that we have over here. He's a he's, he's a giant. He is a giant. A giant I mean, I guess boost. if you really want to try to stack some on D20s, be no. my guest. Here, here's some fool's gold too. Handsome fool's gold. All right, boom stacker. <laughs> really get it on sanction. Yeah. Okay, my turn. Your turn. <laughs> Untap, upkeep, draw. I am going to. Uh, ooh, this is interesting. Let's play it. I also have a new card. Not only Underdome to add mana to spend to only pay silver bordered costs. Um, but I'm going to just tap it for a pose. My new card, Alexander Clamington. Uh, <laughs> he's a zero four. Ooh. Whenever I cast a wordy spell that has four or more lines of rules text, I get a scry two. And I can pay a mountain and a colorless tap him. To choose target creature that I don't control, reveal cards from the top of my library, and it gets plus X plus O until end of turn, where X is the number of rules text of the revealed cards. When do I stop? Oh, the top card. Just the top card of my library. He gets plus X plus O. So he's just a defender, basically, but... Um, 
Oh, and then he fights and then he that fights creature. That creature. And then he fights that creature. So your two two could be in uh, booming danger. From your zero four. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, I'm gonna pass turn. Uh huh. That sounds like what I would expect. Just wait. Just wait. Mm hmm. Oh my goodness. It does have subtext. All dice must be stacked vertically, one on top of another. Because it says just stack them on top of the card. I was like, you can make more than one stack. Okay. You have to stack two dice. Okay. This is going to get dangerous. It's a 4-4. Four, four. Can I, like, bang the table? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I... <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, eh, do I want to do that? Eh. Yeah, I'll go ahead and, uh, trade with your kitten. Take four? Take four! Didn't want to, didn't want to block with the Clamilton, huh? Nah. Go ahead. Okay, untap, upkeep, draw. Um, I will play... <laughs> A land for the turn. So I'm just gonna play Chicken a la King. A 2 2 bird that whenever a 6 is rolled on a 6 sided dice, put a plus 1 plus 1 counter on each bird. Tap and untap bird I control, roll a 6 sided die. <laughs> Let's do it! Oh wait, no, I'll, I'll wait until, I'll wait until, uh, I'll wait until, I'll put a little reminder. Go ahead. He has to attack every turn, so. He has to attack every turn? Yes. Gosh. <laughs> Good table. Good table. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I am going to tap, I'm going to, uh, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna tap an untapped bird I control to roll a six sided die. Not gonna block first? Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna say that that counts. What did it land as? What does it land as? It ran as a four. Okay. <laughs> you saw my strategy. <laughs> Look at her bigger dice. Okay, I'll take six. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, second. I'm gonna play MC. Uh, whenever another creature enters the battlefield, I may stand up and say in a deep booming voice, presenting and that creature's name. If I do, that creature enters the battlefield with a plus one plus one counter. Okay. My turn? Your turn. Okay. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw. Uh, I'm gonna play a land for the turn. I'm going to. pass the turn to you. It sounds like there are options. There are, there might be options. <laughs> this is dangerous. <laughs> this is dangerous over here. <laughs> Coming in. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, oh my no. gosh. Oh no, this this is look this looks dangerous. Okay, um I will oh my gosh. <laughs> I will block but I before <laughs> <do you> know? <laughs> okay. I know I, I need to get a bigger six sided die. Like I should go grab from my deck box. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, there's a big one. Oh, all right. <laughs> we have acquired a large dice. All right. Here we go. Ah! <laughs> it's just like bouncing into it. All right. And it was a one, so I don't get a camera on my bird. He got it. He definitely got in some damage. There's no doubt about that. He he came in a booming. 
boom boom make me say one say well well <laughs> Well, I tried to go boom, boom, boom. You did try and go boom, boom, boom <laughs> over there. Presenting! Uh, excuse me, it's when it enters the battlefield. Abstract Iguan Art. In response to you casting before okay. it enters the battlefield, I have a response. I am going to activate... Alexander Clamington and choose target creature that I don't control. MC. <laughs> I'm going to reveal it and it gets plus X plus O. It says one, two, three, four, five, and they're gonna fight. So that happens before it enters the battlefield. As a, you may cast the spell, but it must resolve before it enters. So I liked your announcer voice, but I'm, I'm not into. It. I'm I'm the I'm the show right now. Alexander Planetin has the muscle. Hmm. It's a stick up, stick up, stick up. <laughs> hmm. Alright, go ahead. Okay, untap, upkeep, draw. I will play a land for the turn. And I'm going to go ahead and play my Elvish Impersonators. Uh, as it enters the battlefield, roll a six sided die twice. This one was lucky for me. Four for its power and three. So it is a four three. Let's put that there for you. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to uh, attack for two. Okay. Okay, and then I will pass. It was kind of fitting that Elvis stole the MC's thunder, though. Am I right? <laughs> Strategy, smategy. Okay. I'm tap some lands for mana. All right. Okay, no effects? Uh, no effects. It's on cast, so are you going to do that trigger? Just saying. Noting the letter S. Okay. Here's your notes. Four. Strategy strategy deals three damage to each creature and each player. Ooh. Uh, why couldn't you have rolled a six? Well, it still would have. Oh, dang. Well, in uh, it's each creature and each player. That is correct. Well, okay, I guess yours dies too. So we all we all go down. You go to five. I go to eighteen. All right. One away. One away. All right. Anything else? Uh, you look you look to be tapped out. I, yeah, I added some mana before playing this. And oh, okay. So I'm going to play my land and uh, add a mana, and I'm going to cast... Uh, oh, just in case you had to sacrifice stuff? Uh, yeah, just in case stuff was going to happen. Okay. And then uh, let's go with a strutting turkey. <laughs> uh, what... When it enters, exile target creature card CMC two or less from your graveyard. If you have augment, combine it with a host you control. Um, okay, you get priority, so I can't. I can respond to that trigger though before the yep. creature gets put on. Yep. So I'm gonna go ahead and respond to that trigger with Alexander mm -hmm. Clamington. Oh, Zero. with, but not really with. Ooh, ooh. Okay. 
You got Forest there. Okay. All right, my turn. Yeah, Forest online. Um, untap, upkeep, uh, draw, land for the turn, um, and then um, I'm going to tap seven mana. You're going to play the... What? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Playing Mantis, um, it enters the battlefield by being thrown by a distance of at least three feet. And when it enters the battlefield, it fights a creature and opponent controls that it touched as it entered. I did not touch anything. <laughs> I think we can check the replay and see that it bounced <laughs> over my creatures. I gave it a little bit too much of a frisbee. Uh, that's it. I'm going to pass to you. I'm sorry, that's just a second. <laughs> just a second. That's that insect wrestler I was talking about. I need to work on my throwing technique. Yes. Be cosplaying Thalia only taught me fencing and swordmanship. Okay, Goblin SWAT team. Boom, G. Oh, it's a new one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Goblin SWAT team. Okay, Goblin, uh, Goblin SWAT team gets a plus one, plus one counter. Okay. Uh, so it has, say, Goblin SWAT team. Unless... Put a plus one, plus one counter on Goblin SWAT team, unless an opponent so it gets another counter. Wait, what, what, what? Swats the table within five seconds? Oh. Yeah, so every time, so when you okay. say Goblin SWAT team. Okay. Gosh! <laughs> 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 hey, now what if you had the boom guy? I'd be swat! I've been team. waiting to play that. <laughs> oh, untap, upkeep, draw. Uh, I will... Goblin swat team. <laughs> play a... Uh, I am going to... Where's your secret chair? I get a counter. <laughs> I'm gonna play a land for these this. Are turn. These are special SWAT tactics. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay, I am going to play Merman. When it enters the battlefield, I may draw a card. I'm gonna draw a card. It's no strut and turkey. No strut and turkey. Um, okay, and then. I will be activating Alexander Clamington onto your SWAT team. abstract iguanar sword. You didn't say the full name, so that doesn't count. Uh, revealing! Oh, entire! You asked where was my armchair? <laughs> There's my entirely normal armchair with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's a nine four. Take that abstract iguana. Get out of here. That thing is not getting any bigger, and I will make sure that that thing will not get any bigger either. Rules text, right? Lines of rules text. That's all rules text. Not flavor text, rules text. Bye. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. Why don't you fight my goblin SWAT team? Good try. <laughs> I will attack for six. Boo. Pass turn. All right, come on, removal spell. That is. <laughs> got you. Also got a lot of lands over there. All right, coming in hot. It's the goblin SWAT team. Oh, block for three. Uh, it's counter. What? No, you didn't say it. I said coming in hot with the Goblin SWAT team. You just said coming in hot. No, I, I most certainly okay, did. You can watch gonna, the we're replay. Gonna stop, we're going to stop real quick. We're, we are going to watch the replay. Ah! Oh my gosh. All right. And the ruling is. We, we looked at the tape. He and needs to counter the benefits of recording your matches. All right. Trade? 
My guy's a 5'5". Five five. What? Oh, no. I was thinking, I didn't even read your card. I thought it was this guy that was a 0-0. Zero, zero. Oh, I don't even, that was so dumb. All right, well, the, the once Goblin again, SWAT team Once again, ticks. Goblin SWAT team gets it. Oh, it's my turn. Got you with the SWAT team. Well, that's it. Uh, my turn, right? Okay, yeah, go ahead. Okay, untap, upkeep, uh, draw, attack for six. Goblin. You didn't say that. <laughs> I'm attacking for six. No blocks. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to... Goblin SWAT. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I guess I'm just going to pass the turn to you. Goblin slaying mantis. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, go to uh, attacks. Uh, okay. And I'm going to say reveal secret armchair. Reveal your secret <laughs> armchair. <laughs> Attack with the Goblin SWAT team. <laughs> Gets a counter. Gosh! I'm gonna pay two. No, I didn't see it. No. <laughs> I already no. paid the two. You, did, you paid two before you put it on the battlefield. You want to look at the replay? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and it's during your turn, not during my oh. turn. You can put it into play. <laughs> All right, that was my that was my plan. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna block and I'm gonna activate. Ah, okay. Does that damage? All right. <laughs> Go to jail. Ah. Uh, the beginning of upkeep. If you get to roll two six sided dice, if they roll doubles. Go to j sacrifice. Okay. Here's all right. My turn. Yep. Ah, this is so close to death. <laughs> <laughs> that upkeep draw. It's that land that you already know that. Oh, uh, I missed that. We're just gonna <laughs> do it anyway. It's not okay, it's doubles. Not doubles. <laughs> okay, I'll play my land for the turn, and then so that I don't die, I'm gonna just really go for this here and play Avatar of it Me. It is the Avatar of Me. <laughs> it costs three more because I'm 31 so it costs one more for each uh, year I've been alive so there's my casting cost and my three. Its power is equal to my height and feet. I am five foot five. Um, you round to the nearest half so that would be five and a half. And then my shoe size is a six uh, in women's. So uh, this... Avatar of Me is a five and a half six oh, in my no. case. Oh, no. Uh, and then I'm going to, it's not very good at blocking that. I know, that got uh, in there a few times. And then I'll go ahead and pass to you. Untap. Look at my card. Put the armchair back in your hand. <laughs> that was like the least sneaky I've ever done anything in my life. This is not my card. Especially not when it's revealed so that you know that I have I it and you called out. I know. Uh oh. Okay, I block. Oh, I have to block this thing. Okay. And it's five and a half to six. So, Go to three. And the old guard. Okay. Comes to play. All it's right. a 2 1 that can tap things that don't have reminder text. All right. And I pass to you. Uh, and untap. Hey, go to jail. Upkeep. Could be. Two and a six. Oh. It was not. Uh, draw. Uh, this is not really it's not helpful. Looking good. No, because this has to do with casting spells. And then I play this, and I have one blocker, it's but the number of attackers that you have are just huge. Good game. <laughs> Here's a highlight of some black cards from our other game. 
Booster Tutor. Oh my gosh. Well, I uh, did grab a couple of boosters just in case this happened. So, Brock, which booster are you going to pick? We're going with Hour of Devastation. All right, if you okay. would uh, open it towards the camera I and fan it like out, oh, I will look away so that I could, because I don't think I get to see, but so my, my back is turned from the table, but if you will show your cards, yeah, obviously, I guess you could announce them. Maybe I should just plug my ears. Do, 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 do. Going through the comments and uncommons here. I know you get to add any single card. Any single card. I'm only, my colors are black and blue. Wow. Oh, you have to be able to cast it. I, well, there is the Underdome that we both have in the decks, like I have in play right now. But, oh, it's only other colors for silver bordered cards. Yeah, yeah I guess, hmm. guess you can't only get black or blue. Did oh, you get an a, expedition? Did not get an expedition. Uh, an invocation. Uh, that's a, it's an interesting. Hopefully we get to make that happen. Uh, my end step, go to my regular part of my turn, put my land into play in my second main phase, and then I'm going to cast... What? One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. My booster tutor card. Oh! Oh! Mail five, two, three, four, seven. What? Uh, repeat the following it's process. Good. Each opponent loses three life unless that player sacrifices a non-land permanent or discards a card. Okay. Hey, well, guess what? Seven times? Seven times. Uh, one, two, three. Because <laughs> I had so many lands. And I have to sacrifice four more permanents then that are not lands? Or three life. Or pay three life. And I'm at 15, 15. life. Uh... Well, the squirrel farm has been producing me a lot of stuff. Cracks of their thumb. I can re-roll dice with this. Uh, that's kind of useful. The squirrels, or just take nine. No, I'd be taking 12 life. Um, I kind of, I guess I'll get rid of the thumb and these three. Uh, I'll take, I'll take, oh my gosh. Okay, four, take three life down to 12 would be five, and then I should just get rid of three squirrels. Okay, that's what I'm doing. No life, no life, just uh, getting rid of these. All right. Jeez, wow, all right. Anything else? Um. Yeah, the giant teddy bear uh, is going to rumble. Okay. You've got to... I'm going to pay two and sacrifice my entirely <laughs> normal arm to make no, you sacrifice the attacking turn. creature. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> wow, those are some crazy games. <laughs> oh, unsanctioned is a lot of fun. I'm really glad that we got a chance to check this out thanks to Addictive Behaviors, our sponsor of this video. <laughs> uh, what I'm, ready to, I'm ready to smash up some more like unsanctioned decks. Yeah, let's go. Next <laughs> round, please. Ding, ding. <laughs> uh, let us know what your favorite part of our gameplay was. Yeah, or your favorite uh, part of the match. Yeah, or your favorite card from Unsanctioned. Uh, and until next time, be fabulous. <laughs>